Our faith communities are united in caring for human life and the natural world. We share a belief in a hopeful future, as well as an obligation to be responsible in caring for our common home, the earth. We recognize the opportunity that COP26 brings in addressing the urgent need for action, in limiting the effects of climate change and the critical importance of decisions made in this conference to take forward the agreement made in Paris in 2015. People have exploited the planet, causing climate change. We recognize that the burden of loss and damage falls most heavily on people living in poverty, especially women and children. We acknowledge the commitments made through the Lambeth Declaration in 2015. Now, because of the gravity of the situation, the impact of climate change around the world and the inequality of its effects, we seek to strengthen those commitments. We commit to respond to this challenge by reflecting deeply in prayer, meditation and worship to discern how to care for the earth and each other and to encourage our respective communities to do the same. Making transformational change in our own lives and in the lives of our communities through individual and collective action. Being advocates for justice by calling on governments, businesses and others who exercise power and influence to put into effect the Paris Agreement to make the transition to a just and green economy a priority and to commit to science-based targets that are aligned with a healthy, resilient, zero emissions future. We remind governments of the commitments made in Paris 2015 to limit global warming to one and a half degrees and of Article 17 of the Universal Declaration on Bioethics and Human Rights to protect the environment, the biosphere, and biodiversity. We call upon them to take the urgent action needed to avert the loss, damage, and forced migration threatened by climate change. We look to governments to work together and with others to create a positive vision for 2050, where addressing climate change is not just an opportunity to stop burning fossil fuels, but also to achieve cleaner air and water, to reduce food wastage, to ensure a just and equitable sharing of the Earth's resources, and to protect the habitats we share with all other life on, on whose health we also depend. Across our doctrinal and political differences, we know that we must change our ways to ensure a quality of life which all can share. We need to provide hope for people of all ages, everywhere, including future generations. To offer hope in the world, we need to have confidence that those in power understand the vital role they have to play at the Glasgow COP26. Our collective energy and prayers will be with those working for a successful outcome.